I have a very, very busy day. And if you guys are gonna make fun of me about my 30 pound weights, please don't, okay? Don't do that. So busy, so crazy. Let's go. Good morning from my boob band and me. Today, we are going to have a great little productive day. I am almost done healing from the surgery, guys. I am probably a week away from when my surgeon is like, you should be good to go. And I'm, I'm so happy because I'm getting so frustrated. I'm getting frustrated with this band. I'm getting frustrated with the dropping and like fluffing. Like I'm still gonna have to deal with that. If you guys don't know what dropping and fluffing is, it's literally like your implants dropping into their pocket where they're going to settle. And then them like fluffing kind of up and opening because you have to think that they're really tight. And I got mine under my muscle. So they're just really tight under the muscle. And the more that also relaxes and stretches and also gets used to the implant. I'm so ready for that part to be done. That's like journeys away, but I am about a week away from when the doctor said I can like pretty much go back to normal activity, normal workouts that I want to do. Right now I'm basically just limited to walking and like some stretches, but not even a lot. I'm ready to get back to my regular schedule, but when you get your boobs done, you're like out from your regular schedule for at least six weeks. That's at least what my doctor told me. And it's it's been a lot, guys, because I'm a very active person. I'm a very productive person. I have a very, very busy day. We're gonna hit the treadmill right now because walking is good to get these puppies down. It's good for your recovery. And I have a bunch of stuff from Amazon. I gotta unbox and steam and get ready to shoot content with probably tomorrow. I feel like I'm gonna shoot a lot of short from tomorrow, but today is basically just like a reset day. I wanna take you guys along that journey with me and show you guys a productive day in my life, recovering from this surgery. I'm telling you guys, you can still be productive. There's no excuses, okay? Did you guys see Rihanna at the Super Bowl? Pregnant, still doing this little number. What's our excuse? Exactly, none. Let's go. Also, if you guys could be like super cute and like and subscribe, that'd be amazing. Like that'd be cute. Like I'm not forcing you or anything, but like it would be nice. You know what I mean? Workout is done. I'm feeling great. I always say I'm gonna do like 20 minutes on the treadmill, 30 minutes on the treadmill. I literally never do that. I always go either 45 minutes, almost an hour, and it's like the best feeling ever. But anyways, I finally got all my Bala goodies in, and you guys, I'm so excited. I have to share with you guys. This video is not sponsored. I don't think Bala even knows who I am, if I'm being honest, but I have to show you guys because I finally was able to get my hands on these products. I was never able to afford Bala products, but I always thought they were so cute. They're so aesthetic pleasing they're like what every girl they should have in their at home gym if they have like an at home workout routine like they're so amazing so these are my ankle weights that i actually didn't work today i completely forgot to put them on but i put them on almost every single day even if i don't work on the treadmill if i take my son to the park you guys i wear these because they're just an extra little weight to put on to help like, you know, get your pump on. And then I got my power ring, which this is like their version of a kettlebell. This is my 10 pound ring. I still haven't used it, but I'm so excited to use it because it just looks so like easy to use. But it's 10 pounds, it's a cool little ring. I feel like you can do like squats with these. Like there's just so much you can do with this ring. And again, I know I hate to be that girl, but I just am that girl. Like if I could have something that's more aesthetically queasy to do things, I'm more likely to do things. Like I'm more likely to work out if I have a cute outfit on i'm more likely to use these things if they're cuter like it's what i am it's how i work and they do have different weight sizes i'm pretty sure i got the 10 pound one because i'm not that strong and then these are my three pound bala weights weights you hold they look like little pills i love these so much because again they're like they're just so cute they're so aesthetically pleasing they're adorable and like they're nice. And if you guys are gonna make fun of me about my three pound weights, please don't, okay? Don't do that. I'm not the kind of girl that honestly lifts weights. For me to lift anything, you guys should be proud of that, period, because I don't lift weights. I can't find anything more boring. I'm also not a girl that's trying to get very bulky. I like to be like small and slim, but I do know that you do have to incorporate weights in your workout. I know, I get that. But baby steps, guys, <laughs> baby steps. Anyways, I wanted to share these with you guys and tell you that I found them on Amazon. So they are 
are pretty much accessible to anybody and everybody who's interested in getting them because Amazon is like the universal store. That's where I got mine and I'll have them linked in my Amazon storefront. So go check them out. I have to go shower because they smell so bad. Out of the shower, I have decided I'm gonna do probably the quickest makeup, quickest hair, quickest get ready with me of my life because I do wanna look cute today. Like I've decided like I want to look presentable in some way. And even though I'm basically just gonna be home, like I owe this kind of self care to myself. So I'm gonna go ahead and like do like the smallest amount of makeup, but just like a face. You know what I mean? By the way, the Solani coffee is so good. I was gonna just throw my hair up and not do anything to my face, but I was like, no, it's a productive day and I might shoot some short form. So might as well get a good face in while I can. It's gonna be super simple, super basic and not much to it, but definitely going to do something. Like I owe it to myself. Plus the baby's napping, so why not? As moms, we gotta take advantage of these little moments as much as we can. Can I get an amen? So I got some stuff from Amazon that I need to unbox and I figured why not do it together because this is definitely gonna be like probably the most productive part of my day, guys. I have to get this set up just to prep myself for the week because I bought this little coat, not coat rack, but like clothing rack. I don't know if you guys remember my really pretty black one. I ended up giving that to Brandon and he took that to his property and he uses it to hang like his props and stuff, but it was too big to fit in like my little studio and it's too big to fit in this room. So I went on Amazon and I found this perfect little minimalist one here. And I'm so excited to set it up because I feel like this is gonna be perfect to do like TikToks and short forms and all that. And I have to set up some clothes on it so I can be ready to film throughout the week. Cause I'm gonna shoot a lot of short form this week. Like this vlog is probably gonna be like my long form video. I actually have one makeup video I'm planning to do. But other than that, it's basically just gonna be short form for the rest of the week, which if you guys don't follow me on TikTok and Instagram, definitely follow me there because I am so active there. But I'm just kind of prepping for like spring content. Spring content is on my favorite content because I love the spring, especially here in Northern California. It's so beautiful and it's always the perfect weather here. Like always the perfect weather in spring. You see that? It's like a cute little minimalist clothing rack. I'm so excited. Okay guys, so this is as good as I got it. It's not bad, it's a little crooked. Like I feel like like this part and that part should align and they're not, but it's fine. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox all of these clothes, get them hung and then hopefully get them prepped for tomorrow. All done here. You guys, my little rack, it looks so cute. I'm so proud of it. Like, look how cute and like minimalist this is. I'm so excited to start shooting content with this thing. You have no idea. So now baby is awake and I told him I would take him to the park. I'm just waiting for Autumn to get back from school so I can take them both to the park. We're probably gonna only go for about 20, 30 minutes cause then I have to run and take Autumn to her therapy appointment. Like I said, guys, this day has been just go, 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 go. So busy, so crazy, but definitely like I'm so glad that we decided to do it. So glad we're staying productive. Literally all good things. I'm gonna grab my little Stanley cup, get some water in my body because I feel like I'm literally parched and all I've had is that protein drink. So I'm not really hungry, but I'm definitely gonna have some water. Oh. 
girl, we made it to Autumn's therapy. We got our Starbucks and something super tragic happened, you guys. I ordered my delicious brown sugar shake and espresso and I forgot to add my pump of hazelnut and it like does not taste the same at all. Like it's still good, but like that pump of hazelnut makes it everything. Like it makes such a huge difference. But anyways, it's okay. At least I got my croissant. My croissant's still really good. And now we're gonna go to Autumn's little therapy. And I'm gonna probably work on my iPad or something. I don't know. I put in my camera and we're on our way to Whole Foods. We just ate with her, my mom's ambondigas. Shout out to my mom. We gotta go get fruit. We gotta get groceries for the week. can't find my camera. I think Brandon ate it. Huh? I, <laughs> I can't find my camera, but I couldn't think of a better way to end our night than with crumble. <laughs> so not that. And we're gonna have crumble and we're gonna watch you. And that's gonna be the end of this vlog. But thank you guys for hanging out with me. Say bye.